Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is Sean's View Entertainment right here on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe as this is going to be a loaded day of rumors, news, headlines, gossip, and everything else in between the WWE. You want content, you want to be updated, Sean's Entertainment is the place for all your WWE needs. According to WrestleZone and according to other multiple sources, the link to proof the source will indeed be in the description of this video and this can only be viewed as a major positive. The Miz has started to show frustration within his character and showed signs of a heel turn at WWE's live event in Belfast, Ireland. Now, yes, this was a live event, which means it was untelevised, so this is not going to show here in the United States, only if you're in Belfast, Ireland, live at the event. The Miz was facing Kofi Kingston and cut a heel promo before the start of the match. No word moving forward if this is confirmed to turn into a heel turn on WWE TV in the United States, but it did indeed happen in Belfast, Ireland. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, I think it's time for The Miz to go to that place in his career. It's time for The Miz to switch things up again because, obviously, the way that The Miz was trying to evolve, and I, I, I give credit to the WWE creative team and The Miz for trying to create a different aura and, um, you know, try to, you know, think outside the box, and that's fine and well, and I, and I credit the WWE and The Miz for that, but it was not materializing. Some things you're going to change and you're going to try to, you know, um, go in another direction, but sometimes planes don't always come to fruition, and then that's exactly what happened. Then they tried to have the Miz take over Ric Flair's moniker and his his gimmick of styling and profiling, even going as far as Ric Flair, uh, you know, having his moves emulated by the Miz and him doing the the figure four leg lock and the wooing, and then Ric Flair all of a sudden WWE and Ric Flair fell apart, and the Miz kind of just fell out of that whole uh, character development of being the next Ric Flair, and there's no way that the Miz could ever fill the shoes of Ric Flair. But I will go on that record saying that The Miz definitely plays a hell of a better heel than he does a face because that comes so natural to The Miz. The Miz is so good in that phase. The Miz makes you believe that, you know, he really is into what he is doing. And The Miz had a great run as the WWE Champion. I mean, he made you hate him. And The Miz was just one of those guys that, you know, he could get underneath your skin and he, and he could irritate you in the worst of ways. So, you know what? I know a lot of people can't stand The Miz. I know a lot of people want The Miz to just go away. But you got to give credit where credit is due. And you got to say that The Miz is a good heel. And uh, the, the whole face turn, well, it, it, like I said, it just did not... Uh, you know, it, it, it did not come to be. It's it's something that they tried. It's something they worked on. It's something that they thought that was going to, you know, blow up into this major thing. Maybe they thought The Miz was going to be the next face of the WWE, but that was not the case. And when push comes to shove, it is time for The Miz to indeed be a heel. So let's just, just hope that this happens in the United States and this wasn't just a teaser in Belfast, Ireland. Your comments and your opinions on The Miz's possible heel turn. Subscribe, and as soon as this video reaches 50 to 100 likes, a new video will be uploaded because it's going to be a jam-packed day of rumors, news, and headlines. Subscribe.